here it is. This is the official trailer. Matt Walsh, am I racist? So that's he's with the Daily Wire. I disagree with him on about a whole bunch of shit. I think he's kind of a dick, especially when it comes to uh, things related to like gaming and pop culture stuff. He's like kind of a typical stick up the ass conservative type of dude. So there's a lot of people that don't like him, but he has really good points. And I really liked his work with what is a woman. So hopefully it's the same spirit of that with this. Am I racist? And he freaking destroys them. Let's be clear what's happening in this country. Hold up. All right. Crack it open and take a little look. See, I'm here for it. Let's be clear what's happening in this country. It's Nazism. Republicans are Nazis. You cannot separate yourselves from the bad white people. Growing up in the 90s, I never thought much about race. Sure, you noticed, but it never really seemed to matter that much. At least not to me. Being a white, straight, cisgender man, it's the top of the pile. I'm on the top of the pile. That's me. Am I racist? I would really appreciate it if you left. I'm trying to learn. I'm on this journey. Can you please leave? If I'm going to sort this out. I need to go deeper undercover. If I want to be an ally, I need to look like one. Oh, shit. Dude, he's going to be undercover liberal. Come on. The white savior liberal undercover. Come on. What is racism? Martin Luther King said not to judge. No fucking way. The moped, dude. The little, like, scooter. What is racism? Martin Luther King said not to judge people by the... Martin Luther King said a lot of stuff. Is America inherently racist? What the hell is that? The word inherent is challenging there. America is racist to its bones. All of the... So inherently. Yeah. The entire system has to burn. And I'm not going to even use save this country. This country is not worth saving. This country is a piece of shit. Oh, sorry. Sorry. They gonna say I'm racist. Joining us now is Matt, certified DEI expert. Here's my certification. Where are you guys on your anti-racist journeys? <laughs> so I'll look around the room and point to who we believe is the most racist person in the room. We want to rename the George Washington Monument to the George Floyd Monument. Would you mind signing it? You will? What <laughs> They're gonna make the obelisk the George Floyd instead of... Dude, rename the Washington Monument. 30% increase on the height for the black obelisk. That shit's fucking hilarious, dude. That's really funny. Oh my God. He's getting people to sign that shit. You will. What do you think about this issue of heteronormativity and how it intersects with the broader structures of racism in society? Oh. They gonna say I'm racist. What's up with white people? <laughs> what are you doing to decenter your whiteness? Who's making it the center? Why are they doing that? And what you're doing is you're stretching out of your whiteness. This is more for you in this field. <laughs> white folks, white trash, white supremacy, white woman, white boy, white entitlement, white. centering, white silence. Is there a black person around here? There's a black person right here. Does he not exist? They gonna say I'm racist, but they call everybody racist. Hi, Robin. Hi. And what's your name? I'm Matt. Matt, hi yeah. Matt. <laughs> nice to meet you. I just had to ask who you are because you have to be careful. <laughs> Never be too careful. They gonna say you racist. Oh shit, dude. Welcome to the Free Thinkers Review. That's gonna be hardcore. Like you could never be too careful. Do you know who that I think that um White Fragility Lady. Is that the white fragility lady? You guys got to tell me. He's like, you could never be too careful. And he's going to expose the fuck out of her in this movie. Oh my God, dude. I love that. Okay. Okay. But they call everybody racist. Listen, I have, uh, I, I'm not the biggest fan of the Daily Wire. I subscribed to them for one year so that I could buy What is a Woman, and I watched it, thought it was great. Uh, then I canceled them. After, I had, I had a pretty big complaint because they, like, auto-re-upped me at a higher rate for the whole year, and I was like, dude, I'm so broke. You can't do this right now. Okay. 
and I only use them one time to watch What is a Woman. Um, that's false. I checked a couple of shows one time, and they had so many fucking ads during the shows that I was paying to be able to see that I was just like, no, I'm not. I'm not watching any of this. No, thank you. So no offense. I mean, I do ads, but I don't have a paywall for you to get to see the content and then ads. So I thought that was a little fucked up. But hey, you know, capitalism. I don't I don't have a problem with people making money. It just wasn't my deal. Okay. All right. Anyways, uh I think that's going to be a banger. I'm really excited for it. I'm excited for whatever damage it does to the retarded people in society that think that we have some kind of a white supremacy issue when they're throwing white people at the bottom of the barrel and stomping on their heads um, all day, every day. It's like, there's a pretty limitless minority privilege going on right now. Only, only, okay. Here's the only systemic oppression that I would totally agree with is uh, fatherless oppression. If you're fatherless, that's like the most oppressed class of people. A father in the home. There you go. Doesn't matter the doesn't matter what the demographic is. Hold up from haters. Suck ass. We should have a viewing party on the channel. Uh, what are you referring to? Oh, you're saying for that. That would be kind of awesome. That would be kind of awesome. I'd probably get sued by the Daily Wire. But we should do it. Watch party fodder. I'll be like, hey, Matt, do you care? And they're like, oh, yeah, we're taking your channel. It's like, but it's on Rumble. They're like, we don't care. It's happening. Getting <laughs> getting it out of the... We're <laughs> crushing you. Johnny, I was fatherless growing up and it sucked ass. Yeah, sorry to hear that, dude. That's a legitimate disadvantage. So... But on you for keeping your head on your shoulders and not being a horrible human being. And I mean, I don't know your extensive full history, but that that legitimately would be a massive disadvantage to anyone, especially men. YouTube has unceremoniously demonetized the channel. I'll support in the links below. Do you think you can stop the Freethinkers Rebellion? We've only gotten stronger. <laughs>